Also, women journalists across Africa are speaking on the challenges they experience on the job while advocating a push for equal rights. Esther Mokwariola reports from Morocco. Women make up 49% of the world population. They are our daughters, sisters, wives, mothers, colleagues, and even bosses. In an interaction I had with some women journalists, some of them tell me the beauty of being called a woman. It means the whole world. I mean, everything. It's, 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 it's everything. I mean, you're doing everything. It's, it's so stressful now because we are no longer playing traditional roles. Uh, in Tanzania nowadays, we, we are stepping ahead. For instance, once you come to education sector, we are equal. Uh, and this is happening because of the police. You see, there's this thing about women. Women always have solutions to problems. We quickly switch into something better and then we say, okay, what's next? What can we do next? So instead of allowing our problems to eat us up, we want to eat the problem up. Though the last decade has seen a transformation of women in political leadership as parliamentarians, ministers, and even a head of state, there are some factors limiting the rights of women, especially in Africa. Women, they have a right to take over now because most of the rules and most of uh, the things or constitutions, you will find men are the one who put it. And most of the taboos also, men are the one who said it. You don't have to feel intimidated by anybody once you're a woman. You know, you know in, in our today world, unfortunately, you, find, you still find some communities, even families, who do not want to educate girls. I would like to see uh, in Morocco women enjoying the same rights uh, as, as men, not only on, on laws but uh, even on uh, realities, because equal rights uh, are for everyone. Yeah, I would want to see us being respected more, um, especially in those communities. I mean, I feel so sad when I see some women, you know, doing everything they can, bending their backs and trying to please the men. This year's theme of International Women's Day, Each for Equal, is expected to spark a global reminder that a woman shares equal right with the man. But how far can this go in changing stereotypes and building a more equal society? Esther Macquariola, TVC News, Casablanca.